Here are some notes on disseminated intravascular coagulation, or DIC, in pregnancy. This is a life-threatening condition characterized by systemic inflammation and widespread activation of the coagulation system. There are some etiologies that are unique to pregnancy that can trigger DIC, placental abruption, postpartum hemorrhage, and hypertensive disorders of pregnancy. Your treatment goals are to identify and treat the underlying cause, to provide supported care, to expedite delivery of the fetus, and to resolve the coagulopathy. There are some parameters that you want to maintain, euvolemia, euthermia, oxygen saturations above 95%, and acid base balance. Some transfusion targets are listed here. Your hemoglobin should be kept above 7 using packed red blood cells, platelets above 50,000. Your PT and PTT less than 1.5x the upper limit of normal. You could do that with FFP. And fibrinogen should be at least 300 using cryoprecipitate or fibrinogen concentrate. Some other important clinical considerations. Neuraxial anesthesia is contraindicated in this case because your uh, coagulation is all messed up and your uh, coag studies are all wrong as well. General anesthesia is usually required for that cesarean delivery. Remember, you want to um, deliver the baby as soon as possible. You want to establish IV access for resuscitation if you don't already have that, and you want to perform frequent lab monitoring. Um, you also want to implement your massive transfusion protocol if it's needed to meet these transfusion targets.